Hi guys, today I am going to uh, teach you uh, areas that is uh, area is calculated through double integration. So it is a part of double integration. Here uh, we have an example where using double integration find the area uh, bounded by the parabolas that is uh, x is equal to y square um, and x is equal to 2y minus y square. Now we have to find out the solution. So now we can write this equation as y square is equal to x which is a parabola is a parabola with vertex at origin. The other parabola, other equation is also a parabola which is equal to y square minus 2y is equal to minus x. It can be written like that. This can be written as y square minus 2y, we will add 1 this side, minus x plus 1, both sides we are adding 1, therefore we get is y minus 1 whole square is equal to minus x minus 1. So, which has vertex at 1, 1, 1 and 1. Now, let's find the point of intersection. We have y square is equal to 2y. I am trying to solve these equations simultaneously. Therefore, 2y square is equal to 2y. Therefore, y square minus y is equal to 0 or y we take common y minus 1 is equal to 0. Therefore, y is equal to 0 or y is equal to 1. When y is equal to 0, x is also equal to 0 and when y is equal to 1, x is also equal to 1. Therefore, the points of intersection are 0, 0 and 1, 1. Now, therefore, we will try to plot the graph region would be, region of integration rather would be as under, I will draw it the equation y square is equal to the first equation, the uh, this equation y square is equal to x is given by, it is a right handed parabola, so it will open on the right side with vertex as 0, 0 that is O, vertex is O and we have here the y axis and the x axis. Suppose we have a point here 
one one. The other parabola has its vertex, and it passes through one one, and its vertex is at zero zero. So here we have zero and one where it touches the y-axis and zero zero. Now we can sketch the region. Therefore, the limits are x is equal to y square to x is equal to 2y minus y square and y is equal to 0 to y is equal to 1. Hence, a is equal to y is equal to 0 to y is equal to 1 and x value would be x value would be x is equal to from this equation this can be written as x is equal to y square to this equation where x can be written as 2y minus y square. So it is y square to x is equal to 2y minus y square dx dy we will integrate it with reference to x first. So this will be 0 to 1 x and the limits that y square to 2y minus y square dy it is equal to 0 to 1 2y minus y square minus y square dy which is equal to 0 to 1 2y minus 2y square is equal to 2y square by 2 minus 2y cube by 3 0 to 1 which is equal to 1 minus 2 by 3 which is equal to 1 by 3. So that is our answer. Now let us take up another example. This example is the same that uh, find the double integration by double integration the area bounded by the curve y square to a minus x is equal to x cube and its asymptote. Now here the curve is represented as under we can say this is the y axis x axis I am drawing the asymptote, I mean I am drawing the curve, the asymptote is here. We know that the equation of the asymptote is, its asymptote is x is equal to 2a, this is x is equal to 2a. This is O, this is y axis, x axis, 0, 0. Area is given by 
I'll take this as the area. I'll take this area first and then I'll twice make it make it twice by multiplying two times. So it is from this axis 0 to this asymptote that has been given to us 0 to root over x cube divided by this will come down that is 2a minus x and it is from 0 to this line that is the asymptote that is x is equal to 0 this is y y is equal to x is equal to 2a we will integrate it with reference to y first dy so this gives us 0 to 2a y 0 to x cube divided by 2a minus x dx which is equal to 2 0 to 2a it is x cube 2a minus x dx to integrate this let x is equal to 2a sin square theta because this has to come out of the root so that is why we are taking so dx therefore dx is equal to 4a sin theta cos theta d theta so when x is equal to uh, 0, theta is equal to 0, x is equal to 2a, theta is equal to pi by 2. So our equation changes to 0 to pi by 2 root over 2a sin square theta whole cube by 2a minus 2a sin square theta 4a sin theta cos theta d theta. Now, therefore, a is equal to twice 0 to pi by 2 root over 8 a cube sin to the power 6 theta 2a 1 minus sin square theta. 4 a sin theta cos theta d theta which is equal to 2 0 to pi by 2 root over 4 a square sin 6 theta by cos square theta multiplied by 4 a sin theta cos theta d theta which is equal to 2 0 to pi by 2 2 a sin cube theta by cos theta into 4 a sin theta cos theta d theta this cos theta cos theta gets cancelled so what we get here is 16 a square 0 to pi by 2 sine to the power 4 theta d theta which is equal to 16 
a square this by beta we can do it that is 4 into 3 into 2 into 1 into pi by 2 which is equal to 3 a square pi that's our answer okay now we will take up another problem that is we have another problem that is uh, find by double integration the area of the curvilinear triangle uh, lying between the first quadrant bounded by the curves y square is equal to 4ax which is a parabola then x square is equal to 4ay this is also parabola and x square plus y square is equal to 4a square this is a circle. Now here we have two parabolas. and a circle. One parabola opens on the right side and the other opens upwards. That is y square is equal to 4x opens to the right side on the right side and x square plus x square sorry x square is equal to 4ay opens upwards. The equation x square plus y square is equal to 5a square is a circle. with center 0 0 and radius r is equal to root of 5 a okay so we will sketch the region We first draw the circle, then this parabola is drawn, right handed parabola. This is y square is equal to 4ax. Then I will draw this parabola also, it opens up this side. So this is x square is equal to 4ay. Now we are talking about the region of integration integration is this region this region is the region of integration we have this as 0 0 this point o this is x axis this is y axis we will divide this point and its radius we can write this as root 5 of a Suppose this point is B, we are talking about this point B, A, where they meet and uh, this point is A, this point is suppose uh, C. So, we will find out this point also. Now, let us find out the point of intersection. intersection
we have y square is equal to 4ax. Therefore, x is equal to y square by 4a. Therefore, x square is equal to 4ay or what we can put is y square by 4a whole square is equal to 4ay. From this what we get is y to the power 4 by 4 square into a square is equal to 4ay. Therefore, y to the power 4 is equal to 4 cube a cube y. Therefore, y to the power 4 minus 4 cube a cube y is equal to 0 or y if we take common from these two we have y cube minus 4 cube a cube is equal to 0. Therefore, y is equal to 0 or y cube is equal to 4 cube a cube. Therefore, y is equal to 4a. So, we have these two points. When y is equal to 0, x is equal to 0 and when y is equal to 4a, x square is equal to 4a multiplied by 4a. So, therefore, x square is equal to 4 square a square. Therefore, x is equal to plus minus 4a. Therefore, point A, point A can be written as 4A and 4A and O is 0, 0. Now, for point B, we have x square is equal to 4ay and x square plus y square is equal to 5a square. These two equations are to be solved simultaneously. So, from this what we get therefore 4ay plus y square is equal to 5a square or y square plus 4ay minus 5a square is equal to 0. Therefore, y can be written as minus 4a. We are solving it 5 uh, by quadratic equation formula b square minus, uh, uh, minus b plus minus b square minus 4ac minus 4 multiplied by minus 5a square by twice a. So, therefore, y is equal to minus 4a plus minus root over 16a square plus 20a square by 2 which is equal to minus 4a plus minus root of 36a square by 2 which is equal to minus 4a plus minus 6a by 2. Therefore, y is equal to 2a by 2 which is equal to a. Therefore, y is equal to a or y is equal to minus 10a by 2 which is equal to minus 5a. When x uh, y is equal to a we are to find out x square is equal to 4 a multiplied by a which is equal to 4 a square therefore x is equal to plus minus 2 a.
Now for C, we have y square is equal to 4ax and x square plus y square is equal to 5a x uh, 5a square therefore x square plus 4a x is equal to 5a square so here also we get a quadratic equation that is x square plus 4a x minus 5a is equal to 0 so here also we find the uh, by the same equation we can find uh, therefore x is equal to a and y is equal to 2a. So, therefore, point C is a and 2a. Now, we divide the region into two parts and integrate that is region I'll show you the figure we'll go back to the figure and see the region, we will drop a straight line from here and let us say this is D. So, we have these two region that is B A D and then B D C. So, we can write the region as A B D and B D C. Therefore, area A, B, D can be written as this is from A, B, D from this curve to this curve. Okay, this curve now in terms of Y it is equal to y is equal to from this this curve is y is equal to y is equal to x square by 4a to y is equal to this curve y is equal to root of 4ax okay square root of this so the region we will find out that y is equal to x square by 4a to y is equal to 4ax and the region of x also from this point because this b point b point as we have found out the b point that is from the uh, this thing this was the b point was 2a and a a point is 4a and again 4a and c point that we had found out is a and 2a a and 2a so we go back so it will be the point will be from x is equal to 2a x is equal to 2a to x is equal to 4a dy dx so we have the integration 2a to 4a y x square by 
4a by root of 4a x dx. So this is equal to 2a to 4a root of 4ax minus x square by 4a to dx which can be written as 2 root a x to the power 3 by 2 by 3 by 2 2a to 4a minus 1 by 4a x cube by 3 2a to 4a now this becomes 2 root of a 2 by 3 4 a to the power 3 by 2 minus 2 a to the power 3 by 2 minus 1 by 12 a 4 a cube minus 2 a cube so if you calculate this it comes to 18 by 3 a cube minus 8 root 2 by 3 a uh, this 18 by a square minus a square this is one of the region then the next region is the uh, region that is uh, area of the other region area we will see the region that is we will see the graph we will see the graph, graph that is b d c so b d c area will be given by now area b d c it is given by x is equal to a to 2a and y is equal to 5a square minus x square y is equal to 4 root of 4 a x dy dx the, then we do the same integration that is x is equal to a to 2a y root of 5 a square minus x into 4 a x dx which is equal to a to 2a 2 root of a root of x minus 5 a square minus x square dx. So this becomes 2 root of a will come out x to the power 3 by 2 by 3 by 2 to the power I mean this is a to 2a minus this becomes x by 2 root of 5 a square minus x square minus 5 a square by 2 sin inverse x by 5a and here also the limits are a to 2a. Now if you calculate the whole thing put the limits then it comes to 8 root 2 a square by 3 minus 4 a square by 3 plus 5 a square by 2 
sine inverse the whole uh, addition of a and b the total area that is a that we need to calculate 1 by root 5 minus 2 by root 5 uh, sorry this is sine inverse minus sine inverse so this whole is the so this is the whole area that we have now uh, we have just another topic in area that i'll cover in the next lecture thank you